Well, first, uh, we, we keep our finger on the pulse of many of these reports that come out. Um, and unfortunately, many of them are working on old information. I think it's palpable and very evident during the last seven years of the amount of resources and the investments that we're making here in Rhode Island in improving our roads and bridges. It's very apparent, right? You ride around the state, you see roads being paved. Last summer, we paved major roads that hadn't been paid for decades. The problem is those kinds of improvements that we have been making during the last seven years very rapidly are not always accounted for in many of these national kinds of reports that come out, like this one. And many times they're using data that's many years old. It's four years old in some cases. Well, we've made a lot of improvements here in Rhode Island in the last four years that are not accounted for in these reports. We're trying to work with them, and we'll be contacting this particular company that put out this report to check their facts and make sure they're updated with the most recent information. In the last seven years, for example, we have um, gone from having 27% 20 of our bridges uh, be structurally deficient to less than 15% as we, as we stand here today. And we're on the path in the next couple of years to getting below 10%. Many of the reports that reflect um, the old data are not accounting for all the improvements that we've made in the last several years.